Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh My dear students, family and friends 5 Unit 10, lesson 2 Listen and repeat In this part of the lesson, we will know some new words Now listen Listening 76 Listen and repeat Column Statue Steps Archaeologist Carving Jewelry Pot Block So again, repeat the words Column, statue, steps, archaeologists, carving, jewelry, pot, block. And now let's move to the second part of the lesson. Write the word. In this exercise, I should complete the missing parts of the sentence. This is a definition of the words in exercise number one. Number one, dash, noun, a tall, round thing made of stone that holds up a roof. So it's a column. Number two, a noun, a large piece of stone used for building. What is this word? Yes, it's block. Number three, noun, blocks of stone that get higher and higher, that you walk up or down. What is this word? Yes, it's steps. Number four, noun, a person who learns about the past from all things they dig up from the ground. What is this word? Yes, it's archaeologist. Number five, noun, the shape of a person or animal made from stone or wood. Yes, it's statue. Number six, noun, a shape, picture or pattern made in stone or wood with a knife. What is this word? Yes, it's carving. And now let's move to the third part, the working with words. We add the suffix full to some nouns to make adjective, to make adjective. When a noun ends in a consonant plus the letter Y, we remove the letter Y and add I F U L like beauty, beautiful. So, what are the vowels letter? The vowels letters are A, E, I, O, and U. So, all other letters are consonant. So, if the noun ends in a consonant, plus the letter Y, we remove the letter Y and change it to I. And now listen and repeat. Listening 89. Listen and repeat. Wonder. Wonderful. Cheer. Cheerful. Help. Helpful. Care. Careful. Play. Playful. And now let's see this exercise. 
right? Would you like some dash help? In this exercise, I choose if I write the noun or adjective of the word. Number two, there is water on the floor. B. Here I use noun or adjective. So I use adjective. So be careful. Be careful. Number three. Work and dash are both important for school children. Here I use a noun. So work and play. Work and play. Number four. Look at the colors in that painting. They are. So here I use adjectives. So they are beautiful. They are beautiful. And now open your workbook. And exercise number one, complete the sentences. I use these words to complete the missing parts, columns, statue, carvings, pots, steps, jewelry, blocks, archaeologist. Number one, my uncle is an archaeologist. He studies things from ancient times. Number two, Roman women liked pretty things and wore dash and makeup. The word wore, this is a bust symbol of wear. So the answer is jewelry. Number three, the front of museum has three stone dash which hold up the roof. So what is the word hold up the roof? Yes, it's columns. It's columns. Number four, there are lots of people walking up and down the dash of the library. The answer is yes, steps. Number five, pyramids are made of big dash of stone. Big what? Big blocks. We found dash at the site, so we know that the Romans cooked here. We found excellent puts. Number seven, there is a dash of the president in the park. There is a, yes, statue. Number eight, the door had beautiful dash of fruit and flowers on it. Yes, it's carvings. Now let's move to exercise number two. More words. Match the pair of words to the pictures. Then write noun or adjective. Here I have a list of noun and adjectives. Fearful, thoughtful, color, fear, thought, colorful. In picture number one, this is color, it's a noun, and colorful, adjective. In picture number two, what we use here? Yes, the word fear, it's a noun, and what is the adjective of fear? Yes, it's fearful. And look in picture number three. What does she do now? Yes, I use the word thought as a noun. And what is the adjective of the word thought? Yes, thoughtful. Thank you, my dear students, with my best wishes. See you, inshallah, in the next lesson.